How's it going everybody? I want to give you a quick update on my progress. Uh, it's been a couple days since I made the last video, but um, you can see I've uh, got the first rack installed. PDUs. I uh, got the second monitor or the area where my workstation is going to be, the monitor there. I'll be sitting about right there if I need to work on something in here. Been working on the wiring. Uh, I've actually got a licensed electrician coming out on Tuesday to uh, look over my work and correct any problems that I have and any code violations or anything that I'll get gigged on uh, when I have it inspected. Uh, but anyway, so hopefully he's going to come out and uh, get me on the right track. Like I said before, I'm not a licensed electrician, but uh, you can kind of see my work. Um, got all the switches done. Um, went ahead and made some additional runs and added another 120 circuit. You can see that I need to get an additional circuit breaker to go right here. Uh, obviously there's no lights in this video because I finally got the lights uh, tied into the circuit panel and um, or breaker box and the uh, light switch. So no lights until I get uh, power from the service uh, from my house. That's going to be a, a 60 foot drop or I'm sorry a 60 amp drop uh, from my house in PVC buried and then plan to come in here drill that out uh, put the appropriate bushings in here uh, and bring the service wires out into here So guys, I'm probably about 90% finished now. Obviously, I've got a couple uh, couple little areas I still need to work on. Um, but I'm probably 90% done. So getting there, getting close. Um, like I said, just a quick update. Uh, just about everything's done now. Just to ha have to have the uh, professional come out and critique me and fix anything that I've messed up and hopefully this coming week after I get inspected um, we'll be able to start putting putting the rigs in place uh, you can see the filter over here uh, that is going to be my first solution uh, for the intake vent on the uh, front door of the shed uh, I'm going to build uh, a mount uh, that all the air is going to go through uh, as it comes in and hopefully there's not going to be too much of a pressure drop through that filter. I thought about doing the paper filters but unfortunately with uh, the paper filters I've seen a lot of other guys with um, you know box type setups um, really brings the uh, really restricts the airflow. So that Obviously, that blue filter is not the highest quality material, uh, but they are cheap, and I can change them out every couple weeks, every month, something like that, whenever they get dirty. Uh, and hopefully it doesn't create too much of a pressure drop, and it still somewhat filters the air as it comes in. Uh, I just really don't want uh, big critters or birds or anything like that getting in. But anyway... Thanks for watching guys, and hopefully next time you uh, I make a video, uh, we'll have power to the shed and uh, we can start installing the uh, miners. Thanks guys.